uh, hi everyone welcome to this session uh, so today we will solve this uh, interview question okay so so we have this circuit and we have to find the current flowing through this branch and we have to comment uh, on the uh, like region of operations of this mosfets okay so we can see that there is uh, two p mos and two n mos right we can see that <coughs> this is a common structure right so this structure we can see this is a current mirror circuit right and this is also a current mirror circuit right we can see that so for like for this current mirror section as this 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 all like these two nmos are identical means the w by l and all the parameters are same for this two nmoses okay and here the m1 and m2 mos of p mos uh, p mosfets are both are identical as well okay like w by l of p is equal for this both mosfets so we can see that as this is a current mirror circuit so this is a on milliampere current source right so uh, like due to this current mirror uh, like virtue of this current mirror this m4 mosfet is trying to like uh, the current through this m4 mosfet uh, maximum can be on milliamps right due to this current mirror configuration and we can also this, uh, see that this m1 and m2 uh, p mos are in current mirror as well right so for this like for like for this current mirror this m2 is trying to uh, have a current maximum current of 2 milliamps right i max of 2 milliamps right because both are like both are identical so this current will be copied through this branch right and this current will be copied through this branch right like to this branch but like but this is a series path right there can be only one current can flow right so we can see that due to this the maximum current can be 1 milliamps and due to this the maximum current can be 2 milliamps then what is the consistent solution right so we can see that the on milliampere current is the consistent solution because if there is on milliampere current so this mosfet is happy due to the virtue of this current mirror and here if if on milliampere current is flowing through this part so this like this mosfet is also happy right because the maximum current can be 2 milliamps due to this current mirror section but here is all milliampere right R right but if 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 the current is 2 milliampere here right then this mosfet will mind right right but we can see that the the current cannot be more than on milli uh, like cannot be more than on milliampere in this branch due to this current mirror section right so what is the uh, consistent solution so on milliampere here is the consistent solution right so we find that i here i is on milliamps so we can directly see that if this is on milliamps and this is on milliamps right so this this mosfet is in saturation right both like both these two mosfets are in saturation so the like we know that if the both mosfets of this current mirror is in saturation then the like equal amount of current will be copied as there is like w by l is same and other things are same so we can see that these two mosfet are in saturation and we can see that this 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 mosfet is in saturation like this m1 mosfet right because this is a like constant current flowing through it and and and, and this is the diode connected device we can see that right but we can see that this like the virtue of this current mirror section the ideal current would be 2 milliamps but here the current in current is on milliamps so we know that this curve right so this is our linear section and this is our saturation section so maximum current of the saturation is 2 milliamps so here flowing current is on milliamps so let's say on milliamps up to here so we can see that the the region is like the uh, regi operation region of this MOSFET M2 is linear region, right? 
and we can comment other way as well uh, the maximum current uh, due to the virtue of this current mirror the maximum current can be 2 millions right but it is when possible this both are in saturation as the current is on milliampere so definitely it will be at triode region right triode or linear region so this is how we can like find find the region of operations right so one way to one way to remember this type of circuit is the minimum current right as this is a series branch the minimum current will be flowing through this branch right through this linear branch okay one minute So what we have seen that this these two MOSFETs are in saturation and the current is on milliamps. This is in saturation and this is in triode, right? So what happening is we know that the triode region is given that like for this MOSFET uh, VSD is less than VSG minus mod of VTP, right? So actually what happening is this voltage is increasing, right? This let's say Vx, this Vx voltage actually increasing so that it going to more saturation and this going to more in triode region, okay? This voltage is deciding the region of this two MOSFETs, okay? We can see that if this voltage is increasing like the VDS4 is getter getter, like if this voltage is increasing, VDS will be greater than VGS minus VTN, right? Of this, like let's say MOSFET 4. Okay. So this is actually this is happening. This voltage is deciding the uh, like region of these two MOSFETs. So we have find that I will be the minimum of these two current that is nothing but 1 milliamps. Okay. And this will be triode, in, this will be linear. So if we change this, like if we make this is let's say uh, 5 milliamps okay and this is let's say 10 milliamps right now here in this case the i will be like this this i will be nothing but 5 milliamps then the it will go to the saturation region and it will go to the triad region okay and again this voltage will decide the region of this two MOSFETs okay so thank you everyone if you like our video you can subscribe our channel and please uh, give your valuable feedbacks